So last night, uh, I wasn't watching, but I think I'm pretty sure. Did the 49ers win their game? Oh, they won. Oh, yes. Last minute. Last minute. And I'm pretty sure they beat the Packers. Yeah, they beat them. Ah, Los is pissed. Yeah. Los is pissed. And uh, Ah, I I don't don't, don't feel bad for Los because he wears a 49ers hat. Because it uh, looks good with the outfit. I, oh, he's one of those. Yeah, oh, I'm not to I, give him shit I for saw that. Him po- I saw him wearing a hat once, and I was like, oh, he's a Niners fan. And then like, <laughs> I see him talking about the Packers like it's his pride and joy. <laughs> so I, met, I text him. I'm like, yo. He's like, oh, man, I just wear that because it looks good with the fit. I'm like, I don't know, bro. You can't do that. <laughs> So yeah, I know he ain't too on. happy about hold that. On, hold on, hold on. I, I don't, I don't know too much. I don't know too much about the black and brown culture rules, but I'm pretty <laughs> sure you can't just wear a team's hat because it goes well with. The I don't outfit. know. I, 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 it, it ain't even, it ain't even black and brown culture. I think it's just sports <laughs> culture. Now, sports culture. Yes. I right. think, I think, like if you're gonna wear, uh, like I think if you wear a neutral team, sure, sure, sure. You know, like maybe he wore like. Like an everyone, AFC team. Right. Everyone wears like an LA hat. Yeah, no, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I, when I was watching the game last night, I, you know, I was going to text them, but I don't uh, like I don't like playing dirty like nah, that. No, 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 no. I get it. So uh we think we're gonna see them in the Super Bowl? Yeah, oh no, we're definitely gonna see the Niners in we're the Super Bowl. We're definitely gonna see the Niners in the Super Bowl. So what what is it? Is it we still have the Niners, the What's Ravens? The, yeah. the Ravens and the uh, Ravens are in. They're in the AFC mm-hmm, championship. Mm-hmm, I mm-hmm. think today it's the Bills and That's the, right. um, the Lions. Chiefs. And the yeah. Buccaneers. Yep. 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 Lions and Buccaneers. So whoever wins out of that game, we okay. play in the NFC okay. Championship. Okay. Out of the Lions and the Buccaneers. Yeah. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. So you won't face the Chiefs unless it's they the go. Super Bowl. To, unless it's a Super Bowl. Which okay. I would love because, well, because I'd love to play either Ravens or uh, Chiefs because we lost our last two Super Bowl losses are to those teams. Oh, for okay. We lost okay. to the Ravens in 12, 2012, which broke my heart. Damn. Um, we were that close. And then, of, and then. Three, three years mm. ago, we lost to the Chiefs. Mm. Okay. Okay. Mm. Well, the issue is if you face the Chiefs in the Super Bowl, you've got you've got mother to deal with, and Taylor Swift is probably just going to put a curse yeah. on all of your players, and good. your defensive line probably isn't going to play as well. It's all good. I, I, uh, we don't we don't pay you, attention to the shenanigans okay. when it comes to Taylor you know, Swift. Uh-huh. You know? uh, you're one yeah. it right. No, yeah. no, no. We stay focused. We're good. <laughs> We're good. We got a good running game. No, it's um, I I'm I'm not a huge football fan. I just whoever's in the Super Bowl. I mean, yeah. I'll, I'll root for the Steelers and the Eagles just because of PA. But and growing sure. up, but that's uh, no. So the four. Okay, did you see the uh, the Fox News? They fucked up. I don't know if it was um, yeah. it wasn't. I, I think it was probably just an intern who didn't understand the NFL schedule. But they posted on Fox News last night that said. Usher, Reba McIntyre, and Post Malone will be singing at the Super Bowl 52 halftime show alongside the 49ers and the Ravens. Oh, really? And so now everyone on TikTok is like, that. everyone on TikTok. Oh, because like, it's rigged. It's rigged. Yeah. Yep. Everyone yeah. on TikTok says it's rigged. Yeah. Obviously, Fox News probably just doesn't understand the schedule and they assume yeah. that whoever sure. won this week and not next week. Sure. Whatever. But uh, interesting. So maybe that maybe that's a good sign. Maybe, maybe the 49ers maybe. might face the the Ravens. Or... They say the same thing along like the colors of the Super Bowl logo reveal. Uh, and if you look at the last three or four Super Bowl, oh my god, the logos deep in conspiracy. Were the color. I don't. <laughs> when it comes to that, I'm just like, dude. I think I think it's a cool thing to talk about yeah, yeah, yeah. for a little locker room banter and mm-hmm. water cooler talk, but mm-hmm. I don't buy into that. Shit. Are you a are you a halftime show Super Bowl kind of guy? You it know? really depends. Yeah, I'm not yeah. like this year. I'm like cool usher. Usher, like, fine. Yeah, you know, fine. When it was Shakira and Jennifer Lopez a few sure, years ago, it was a little more sure. Beyonce. I was cool. What about uh? I think I thought uh last year was the big one. Eminem, last Snoop, year was fifty. Uh, no, I think last year was, was uh, year Rihanna. Before? Last that's year right, was that's Rihanna. Right, that's right, that's right. The year before was Snoop 50 yeah. and all them. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. And Rihanna's was okay. Yeah. But, well, you can't well, do much when you're seven months yeah, pregnant yeah. or whatever. She, you know. Yeah, a lot of the stuff that was used in that Super Bowl, because I work at Tate. Okay. So a lot of the stuff that they were using to lift her up, those winches and stuff, uh-huh. I work on those. Oh, okay. Yeah, so it was pretty cool, like, from my perspective, to, to, see, to see them mm-hmm, being ro- rolled mm-hmm, out. Mm-hmm. I was like, yo, I worked on that. I worked. On that. Hell yeah, 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 cool. yeah, yeah, yeah. Awesome. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm rooting, I'm rooting for the team. Um, Thank you. I'm, uh, I we're yeah, welcoming, I think, we're welcoming. You know, I anybody. Think, and I think at this point, are the Eagles out? 
They're out. Yeah, the Eagles are out. Steelers are out. Yeah, I don't have a team in the game. I don't. I'm not. Yeah, don't don't. And, and, and the funny <laughs> thing about Eagles fans is they still want to shit on well, Dallas Cowboy fans. I think your last guest w- was predicting the Eagles Super Bowl, right? Yeah, he was Lewis, pretty confident on that, huh? Lewis, Lewis, and he he yeah. he hit me up and was like, "Yeah, that didn't age too well." <laughs> he gave me props and wished me luck on my team. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. That, that that's what happens every year, you yeah, know. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. I as a, I've been a fan since um 92 or 3. Sure. So, I've seen my team like after mm-hmm. Steve Young left and we just didn't have a winning season after season after season and it was kind of like a joke like you're a Niners fan. <laughs> but listen, it, it is what it is now. Are you uh, are you a gambling man? You bet on the games at nah, all? No, nah, no sports really. book. Every nah. now and then I'll do a little sports book. I'm just not into it. I like to play a little and then I yeah. just that's it. If yeah. if 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 I know the teams relatively enough in the Super Bowl, like when the Eagles played or whatever, I'll do like the bet five dollars and get a two hundred and fifty dollar yeah. or whatever and just pick the team to win. I don't know what a parlay is. I don't yeah. know. Okay, what okay, okay, yeah. I don't know anything about that. I just pick whoever wins yeah. to double my money, but I I've only done that like once or twice. I'm not a Yeah, I'll probably do some for the Super Bowl, sure. just like especially because when the Niners they'll be in it. So I'll probably do a little something for that, but do you have a, what's your, does it feel like maybe a little, little heritage leaks in? Do you have any like special preparate food prep for Super Bowl parties? What's your go-to? My, my wife usually, she'll, she'll probably prep up like a charcuterie board mm-hmm. or she'll, she'll probably make something in the crock pot. Mm-hmm. Um, typically like I'll just make sure, you know, like this should be different because I kind of cut back on my alcohol intake, yeah. like beer. But I usually would get like I made sure I had the beer and you know maybe I, I'm the only one in the house that likes kielbasa and sauerkraut so I'll Ooh. you know like I would probably during the football season okay. I would make that my in laws uh-huh. love it my wife uh-huh. hates it kielbasa and sauerkraut yeah that, to me that's okay. just a okay you know is that is. is that basically the and white people have just taken that to well, pork have, and sauerkraut that's the white person's pork and sauerkraut yeah okay. that, that's exactly what that is and <laughs> yeah, my, yeah, yeah. my ex wife is white so. Uh, and yeah. they're from Pittsburgh. Got so it. when I would go to Pittsburgh and I, I saw this being cooked and smelled, actually, I was like, that actually smells pretty damn good. Oh, okay. So yeah, I, yeah, yeah. you know, and I ate that during football season. Uh-huh. So I just, you know, it was something that I just, I'm just used to. And I just, I enjoy it. But my, my wife, Alexandra does not like the smell of sauerkraut. It's pretty yeah, much what it is. That's my, yeah. She you know. downstairs. Yeah. She won't, <laughs> she won't do it. I'm, I'm a, I'm a, when it comes to the pork and sauerkraut, I'm a, it has to be all mashed in with mashed potatoes kind of guy. Okay, so okay, I, I yeah. mix everything together, but yeah, she won't let me do it. Yeah. 